Be open to it. I don't believe Be it. Be open. Folks, to concentrate. I'm bending that nail. Bend. 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 What it is, what it be, what it do, though. Welcome back to another episode of Alex Wasabi getting hypnotized. Today, we have something very interesting. Yesterday, you saw the video, it was insane. Like, my mind is still blown. It is now the next morning, and I have a new I don't contestant. believe it, I don't believe it. He doesn't believe it. I don't believe it. Be open to it. I don't believe be it. Be open. I'm open, man. This is you right now, we need this, not this. Do you believe that mind controls Absolutely. just as much as physicality? I, I, mind controls everything. Yeah, see? So just open your mind and don't fight it. Just let it happen. Okay, I'll try. I'm really not this good guy. at that. I'm not gonna say the truth. So this is Bradley Martin. You know him. He's been on the channel a million times. We got Kevin Stone back. Hey, hey. Doing what day he two. does. Day two. Day two. And today, it's not about bending the mind, or it kind of is, but it's more about physical stuff. What can we be hypnotized into doing? Can we lift more? Can we get a little bit stronger? I don't know. Let's find out. So I'm gonna explain hypnosis to you a little bit, kind of give you an idea about what it is, what it isn't. Again, most people don't understand what it is and, and why it works, right? And so I'm gonna explain it a little bit, get you a little more understanding of how the process is, and then you can apply it to yourself, or you cannot apply it to yourself. It makes no difference to me. All hypnosis is really self-hypnosis, so we go in and out of it about a thousand times a day. It's a natural tool. Athletes call it the zone, right? Runners call it runner's high. All of that is the same thing of what we're gonna experience today. TV, books, you, know, you have a tendency to sensationalize what this is and what it isn't. I tell people, look, if that was the case, why would I be sitting here? I would've went to the bank today, yeah. hypnotize nah, people, yeah. Drop money in my car and I'm, uh, I'm okay. Or just do whatever I want. Yeah. It's not. It's not the case. So that's why I like to do this: is to educate, uplift, and give you an idea about what it is and how you're actually already doing what it. What it actually is, mm -hmm. yeah. and how you can refine it to work for you. Yeah. So people think uh, straight up. Yeah. You think like <clears throat> literally just like I'm making you do something, yeah. and then you're like, wait, what just? What did I just yeah. do? Completely. I, so I got hypnotized yesterday. I remember everything, but I, I was just in such a cooperative and suggestive state that he told me I could do it, and I did it. So if he right. says I can right. lift something heavy, I'm gonna I, I'm like more likely like to a, be able to because I'm not fighting it. My brain's like it's more my body just doing well, it. Okay, it's so, self belief. Yeah, that's it. It's like the voice in your head is saying you might be able to do this, and then he becomes the voice and he's like you can do this, and then you're just like, all right. Now that we have all introduced ourselves and we become well in it, well uh, well acquainted. Yes. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yes. Let's do it. All right. Let's go. I'm going to go to what I think my max is. If I can lift more than that, I'm going to. But first, we gotta find out what my max is before we can find out what my max really is. I've done this before. This is what my old max used to be. But your boy hasn't worked on it about three weeks to a month. So we're gonna see if I can still even do this. He doesn't like me to say that I can't do something because it's like a mental block. So I can do it. <laughs> it's just I probably can't. <laughs> this is a lot of weight. I don't know. This is 225 bets. More than I weigh. That's so much weight. Okay, we got it. I got it. Okay. Very nice. That was my max. Perfect. Very nice. Woo! Okay. okay. A little bit of a struggle there too I, on your left side, right? Yeah. Okay. So that's the most I've ever done. I've never lifted. I'm surprised I can still do that, but I've never lifted more of this in my life. Okay, here we go. So, now we know my max, 225. Now, for your safety, we're not gonna show you the hypnotism part, because we don't want you to get hypnotized at home and then have nobody to right. guide you like we have Kevin. Right. So, we'll see you guys in a little bit. We've just done the hypnotic process. So let me ask you a, a couple of questions uh, before we get started. Get a good shot of Alex, because again, the more you do hypnosis, the better you feel. So Alex, how do you feel? What's going on? Share with us what's, what's going on. I just feel more relaxed and more focused. Like, I don't feel like loopy, but I'm definitely relaxed to the maximum. It's like more of what it was yesterday. Yesterday, I think I was fighting it more, but now it just feels a little more intense. So Bradley, how do you feel? Hmm. Feel good. Yeah, yeah. Feel tell, tell us exactly how you feel. I feel my body feels very heavy, very just like relaxed. Yeah. 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 I'm super relaxed. Super relaxed. Yeah, I feel like I'm in a. It's almost like a form of meditation. Exactly. That's what the whole thing felt like. That's it. I'm not in control of you. You're in control of yourself. But I'm your guide, and that guide is keeping you in that positivity 
where, again, it's like the endorphin rush. It's like the zone. You want to stay there. All right, so let's do a couple things because we're prepping uh, with my help, your help, Bradley. We're prepping our good friend Alex here, who looks amazing, to get to a point where he's going to get past a barrier, a mental barrier that he knows he can, but the mind was blocking that. So during the hypnotic process, we're going to remove that process. So we're going to, in the process, we're going to do some conditioning. I brought some tools to visually show how we can get past those barriers, and especially being in a hypnotic state, how those barriers work. Alex, you take that and you take that. So Bradley, do me a favor. Take that nail, put it right there in the wood. Don't bang it all the way in because we want to take it back out again, but we just want to prove that these are real steel nails. Go ahead and put the nail up on the table. You can hold on to it, Alex. Okay. We want to keep it visual. Whoa. But the, Whoa. What? No, it's strong. Nice. No, it's, it's, anyway, I don't know. Yeah. I don't know how to yeah. describe this it. This is some of the hypnotic <laughs> phenomenon that's going on where, again, okay, that's good. We didn't want to, yeah, we just want to be able to pull it back out. So that's a real nail, correct? Went yeah. into the wood, right? Excellent. Hold on to that nail. Don't do anything yet for me. Okay, same thing with you, Alex. You're going to put it into the wood. Okay. Just hold on to it. Yeah, I'll put it right here. Okay. So we got a real nail that's you, right? Steel. We're going to remove some subconscious blocks about steel and about how we can actually get through steel in our mouth. So what we're going to do, gentlemen, is you're going to take those nails, okay, just like this. You see this? Two fingers here, one finger here. Got it? Mm -hmm. Okay, good. And you're going to put it right here where you have full control over that nail. Okay, now look at me, Alex. Okay, now, Riley, I want to give this to you. You do the same thing. Don't do anything until I tell you to do so. Okay, bring it up so we can see it in the camera. Okay. So thumb to thumb. Okay, now gentlemen, look at me. You're actually gonna bend those steel nails with the powers of your own mind and my help. Are you ready, gentlemen? Bradley? Yeah. Excellent. Why don't you stare at that nail? Stare at the nail. Focus and concentrate. I'm bending that nail. And I want you to now repeat after me. Bend, bend, and I bend, bend. bend. Vocally, bend. Now as you're bending, I want you to push out with those thumbs and bend that nail with your mind. Bend, 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 bend. bend. Okay, you did a little bit more bending than me. <laughs> Whoa. Now that's pure steel. Well, look at the marks on my fingers. Actually, you can bend that a little more if you choose to do. I Alex. can. Go ahead, put it in the same position. I just tried and I couldn't do it. You can. Okay, I can, I can. Bend, okay. bend, bend. 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 You want to bend that more proudly, you can. Bend, bend, bend. <coughs> You're surprising Sorry. yourselves right now. That's a right angle. Now you see, Alex, how we're going to get you past what you think consciously is your limitation of your weight. How much more weight would be the next level if you were doing the training, or where you are doing the training with Alex, to get him to where he needs to be? 245, 250. So we're gonna get you to that point, and that's where you're gonna continue to move forward from that plateau to the next. So you guys ready? Ready. You ready? Yeah. Let's do it. So, Alex, how are you feeling? Good. Okay, good. Clench your right fist down. Okay. Remember what we did yesterday, right? I can do it. Repeat after I me. I can do it. 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 I am powerful. I'm powerful. I am powerful. I am powerful. Okay, what are we gonna lift? Weights. How much? 245 pounds. Awesome. Down. Let's go. One rep. Focus, concentrate. Remember your breathing. Remember everything your instructor has told you. You can surpass your limits right here, right now. Not because I say so, but it's your ultimate potential. You're gonna max out now. Press. Press. Push. Push. Good. Good. Get up. How are you feeling? That was heavy. But you still did it with a spot. Yeah. Okay. We were able to do that prior too. No. Okay. I could not lift that before. Yeah. That's a lot of weight. Yeah. Usually I couldn't even get that off my chest. Yeah. 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 But you did. And I noticed too, it was good form. As opposed to the first time when we did this, you were lacking on your left. So your left side is weaker, right? But that, uh, was that, was that proper form? Yeah. Yeah. For sure. Perfect. So you see the potential of where you can be. Yeah. So from this point, that is now your max weight. Okay. How do you feel? Feel good. Okay. <laughs> where do you want to go from here? I don't know. 
What, I, what, what do you think? What should we do? I don't know, Bradley. Where were we? Disneyland. Disneyland. That's wrong. <laughs> Let's go to Disneyland. I've never done more than 15 pull-ups before. Really? Let's go. How many? 20. 20. 20. Go. Before, as soon as I pick it up and put it down, it's not going anywhere. But this one, I got it up, and then you finished it with me. But yeah. I'm just surprised I even got that off my chest, and I'm surprised that I'm not like in pain because that was a lot of weight, and that was the most weight I've ever done, and my body's never met that weight before. Yeah. So I thought I would have like it would have been sore, or it's overextended something, but I'm completely fine. A week ago, I uh, dunked, which I'll show you right here. In that video, I landed very hard on my heel, and I haven't been able to walk on my heel at all. I've been walking on my toe, on my left toe, and then my right foot. And even if I barely, if I touch my heel to the ground, it hurts. But I just realized that I didn't do that with, for the time we were out of the office just now. I was walking normal, and then I didn't, it wasn't hurting, and I don't know why. So it's kind of freaking me out. All right, so let's take you out of hypnosis. All right, focus, concentrate, gentlemen. As you do, your eyes are closed. Take a nice deep breath. Release. Nice. In a moment, I'm gonna take you officially out of hypnosis. I'm gonna put you back to your own domain, your own comfortable way of your living. I'm count to five. Take you out of hypnosis. Feeling refreshed and alive, ready to face the rest of your day. Feeling amazing in every way. Zero. Coming up to one, two, three. Coming back to the room, become aware of your environment. Becoming aware of your own body. Four, your eyes gently opening. Five, eyes open wide awake, wide awake, completely out of hypnosis. One, two, three, four, five, wide awake, wide awake. All right, first lifted weights, got hypnotized, lifted more weights, bent a metal nail, more than Brad did, by the way. <laughs> look at that, that's not, look at that. Thank you again, Kevin Stone, for right coming on. through and making this possible. Right on, it's so much fun with you. Effect. Next Good time, we're gonna make this. This Shrek pass out. Shrek. <laughs> we're gonna, we're gonna, uh, we're, gonna we're gonna show him. Yeah, we're gonna further. Yeah. Our accomplishments. This was just the foundation today. Yeah. Yeah. All right. That was. It was interesting. I technically didn't get the weight all the way up, but I did get it off of my chest, and I was able to do more pull-ups than I've ever done in my life. But I think. I just need more hypnosis sessions because the more you get, the stronger you get in anything you do, the more practice you get. So strength, I was a little skeptical on it. So maybe that's why it didn't work. But with a few more sessions, there's another level I can get to. And I'm about to tell you what that level is right now. Pain. According to Kevin Stone, celebrity Hollywood hypnotist, he can block pain from your mind so that you don't feel it or that you feel it a lot less. So like, I could hit myself in the hand with a hammer, and although that would normally hurt, it wouldn't hurt in hypnosis. <laughs> Which is crazy to think about. That's crazy. But I don't know. I Let me know, like this vlog, let me know in the comments below if you wanna see me take it to the next level and test out some pain tolerance stuff. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's gonna be scary. Uh, that's all I got for you guys today. See you on the next video. Until then, do me a favor, don't forget to remember, if you're not smiling, you're doing it wrong.